All right, y'all. So I went to go to this place, but I went 20 minutes before they closed, which is kind of... I thought it was just like a to-go spot. But I said I'd come back tomorrow because they closed. The kitchen's closed. Only drinks. Anyways, I walked by the market. They got all this delicious ass looking fresh fruit. This guy goes, oh, Kim Kardashian, Kim Kardashian. I was like, who? I said I look like who? Yo, Kim K is crazy. Huh? What's the lashes? I don't know. Maybe the hair. And the lashes? Cause Kim, Kim K wear. Kim, Kim K wear. Pretzels and a Kit Kat and water is a very dangerous game to play at 3 p.m. Cause I didn't check the hours for when the restaurant would. Well, the kitchen closed. They closed at four, but that's fair. It's like a sit down place. I'll go tomorrow. It'll be nicer to actually sit down mm -hmm. and enjoy myself. The treatment you get when you look decent is crazy. I've been over this. Anyways, that being said, yeah, I had to come out because I was editing and I realized that I'm going to lose time in this city trying to edit the last one or the last couple ones or whatever. And I had a memory pop up from two years ago when your girl was door dashing and it was me putting the food down by the front door and I took a picture to prove like we didn't take it or whatever. And two years later, I would have never ever guessed I'd be in Croatia right now. <laughs> Chilling, eating a Kit Kat. Well, I was supposed to be eating actual food, but eating a Kit Kat somewhere on like a little... Yeah, but we are very much outside today. I'm supposed to link with my friend from Zadar, uh, one of the girls that I went out for drinks with. The other one's on like a boat tour or whatever, so that's gonna be pretty cool. And yeah, that's it. That's all I gotta say. I'm gonna do mostly travel channel stuff today, so whatever I show y'all will be little snippets. But I'll see y'all later. I tell y'all about the man feeding the pigeons in almost every European country. I came back inside. It's a tad toasty. The sun is not to be played with. Booked my bus ticket to Dubrovnik. They're clearing out the markets right now. All the tables are getting cleaned. It's still really bright out. So I got time. I got time. Time is not an issue, but yeah. Not at six o'clock. Are we going to the beach? <laughs> We're gonna go to the closest one real quick. And yeah, I'm about to go to the supermarket, grab myself some snacks, meet up with my friend, check out the beach. She leaves tomorrow, I got one more day. I'm about to go vlog for the travel channel a little bit. And yeah. All right, y'all, make sure you bring your own bag and you also have to weigh your own produce if you go to, maybe it's just some supermarkets, I'm not sure, but you have to like, if you get produce, you put it in a bag, you go to a weigh station, you put a sticker on it and then you bring it to the record store. They don't automatically, you know, weigh it for you, but I will see y'all in a bit. Uh... And I always see people go all the way out there and I'm like, whoa. Ooh. Just out there. gotta be the conversation for me what's up y'all came straight to the bench to talk to y'all i'm across from these markets just met up with sophia and we went to the beach and we had a great talk like we talked for like an hour and a half and then she went off to dinner i was gonna go to dinner but i had a little snack already so i'm okay but we had the best conversation about men <laughs> marriage kids adopting life economy picking the career path that works for you and it doesn't mean anything's right or wrong she's a doctor she a whole doctor so you know me over here doing my thing like we were just we blended and spoke so well together about just do whatever is right for you and whatever feels good because that's not going to be the right path for the person next to you and you just got to realize that oh that was so nice that was so 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 nice it was my second day i'm about to shower eat do laundry tomorrow i'm glad i used my towel today at the beach so then i could like wash everything in the morning I will do the split vlogs tonight. I just posted the Zagreb one. 
I'm gonna do the voiceovers for the Zadar one tomorrow morning when the hostel clears out. Cause even though there's like eight beds in there, it be empty sometimes. And then I'm gonna do the split vlog tonight, see how much footage I need and add it as I go. Cause I know I'm probably a little short. I've been chilling. I've been sitting a lot. I've been sitting a lot in split. <laughs> like I just think going to different benches and sitting down. So I don't think we explored as much, but I also feel like I saw everything really fast. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm not trying to keep yep yep yapping with these vlogs but it was really cool it was a great conversation <laughs> it was really really fun and we were also talking about the mentality of people who are a little scared to travel which is why i post the way i do like you could just now i'm used to it i'm comfortable i know when i was taking my first trips i was scared i was nervous i ain't have no phone service now i'm comfortable it's second nature just to show up and show out not show out but you know but yeah yeah it's been good it's been really good i'm so grateful 